and dreams of every every little girl and every little boy that ever dreamed of being a major league baseball player rest. Baseball's just the greatest game on earth. Why does it matter if you're a boy or a girl or a man or a woman if you want to play? Baseball is America's sport. It's supposed to be for everybody. Um, I started playing baseball in T-ball and uh, then I kept playing and I had a really great time uh, through up 12 years old and then when I was 13 I had a new coach and he said he didn't want me on his team because girls play softball and that's when I decided that I would forever play baseball. <laughs> I see a connection between um, accessibility of women getting the chance to play baseball and what's going on in our country and, and the opportunities that women have in our country and she was basically told she could go out for the team and she could make the team, but they wouldn't have to play her. It was awful. I had bullying, harassment, abuse, violence, everything you can imagine. When I was 23 and uh, I was holding my daughter as a newborn, I decided, I was looking at her and I thought, I don't want her to struggle to play baseball like I did. And I decided I wanted to build opportunities instead of waiting for them. Baseball for All is a national nonprofit for girls who want to get in the game, whether it's playing, umpiring, or coaching. Essentially, we empower girls to know that their, their dreams are worth it. Um, getting instilled in girls who play baseball and spreading the message to other girls that this is something that is fun, it's rewarding. You, there is a future after Little League Baseball for girls, contrary to what a lot of people believe. In fact, about oh, oh, six months ago, they had a little tournament out here in Chino, California and they had boys teams and we had a little girls team a little baseball for us started by justine siegel and did you know those little suckers they went out there and won that tournament those girls baseball for all is invaluable because what it does is it gives all of us it brings us together right and that being a girl baseball player is it can be an incredibly isolating experience like i thought i was the only girl in the world that was playing baseball I found that Baseball for All had a great uh, website and, and resources available for parents that um, had the same types of questions that we, we asked. I think it's an amazing organization. It definitely gives the girls opportunities to continue to play baseball and continue with playing uh, a sport that they truly love. It is an amazing opportunity to promote um, baseball for girls and if there were more girls teams available then the girls wouldn't feel like they had to go play on the boys teams. You know when I was at nationals in Orlando last month um, we had first ever girls national baseball tournament. We had uh, 12, 13 new teams and two 10 and under teams and you would have never seen that 10 years ago when I was 12 years old. You know I always thought I was alone and I was such a lonely feeling and I it brought me into tears when I looked out there and saw all the little kids together having a good time. 150 little kids out there, all girls, playing baseball, living their dream, having a good time. And no matter what happens in life, they'll never be alone. Um, but now we feel like we have a community of girls and women for the first time that did not exist even as recently as 10, 15 years ago. 
So I think things are about to start changing very rapidly and it's not going to be as difficult a proposition for the girls that are coming along now that are starting out at, at six, seven, eight years old for them to continue and to see that there is a future, that they don't have to give up baseball and become softball players when they go to high school, that uh, baseball is a possibility in their lives and that they can continue to play it and be successful and travel and inspire other girls and women to play and, and umpire. Don't let anyone tell you you can't do something because you're different. Every day you step on that field is a blessing and treat it like one. And, and you know, baseball is a, a privilege, not a right. And if you put your heart and soul into it, it can take you to places that you wouldn't even imagine. You know, I worry that if you tell a girl she can't play baseball, what else will she think she can't do? And I think that it's really important that boys and girls know that anything's possible, that we kind of smash the gender boxes. I hope that you have the same opportunities and the passion and the love for the game that we have and that you will have the thrills and joys of baseball. I hope there's a league of their own. Baseball, baseball is not played on a field. Baseball is played in your heart. <laughs>